Hello my friends, in this one we are going to compare two great overdrive pedals. The pedals we are looking at are the Digitech Bad Monkey, this is a bit of a classic, and this is a complete classic, the Ibanez Tube Scream. What I'm going to do to make it as fair as possible, I'm going to make sure that every time you hear something played, it's the same thing, so I'm going to use a loop station, and I'm going to play a guitar loop through there, it's going to be the same loop through everything, through every preset and every example. What I've done is I've tried to create all the possibilities. So there's some chuggy things, there's some single line things, and there's some spread out chordy things to see how well the string, the string separation works. Okay, so if that's the kind of thing you like, don't forget, like and subscribe. Leave some comments below, tell me what you think of each pedal. Do it as you go, do it at the end, and at the end I'm going to do a comparison and a blind test. You tell me which one's which, and you tell me which one you like best. See you at the end. This is the dry signal, this is just what the amp's getting, there's no pedals in at the minute yet, so this is for reference, here we go. Okay, first test. We're going to go with the Tube Screamer first on all of these. Um, what I've done is I've set the, the gain to zero. I've set the tone straight up the middle. And I've set the level to maximum, which is how you'd use this most of the time, I would think. <laughs> Okay, same test, other pedal, this is the bad monkey. You can probably hear the bad monkey's got that little bit more gain. Let's turn the gain to 50% on both pedals, leaving everything else where it is. Here we go. Tube Screamer first, sounds like this. And now the bad monkey, here we go. Okay, this time we're going to turn the gains all the way up on both pedals. Tube Screamer first, here we go. Now the bad monkey. All right, going to make a little adjustment here. We're going to set the gain of the overdrive all the way back down to zero again. But this time, we're going to take the tone and turn it all the way up. The Bad Monkey has a low filter on it as well. Um, I've left that alone because really, it just affects frequencies that are lower than this can handle. So just for fairness, I've left that alone and I'm only working with the top end on the Bad Monkey. So here we go, Tube Screamer first.
All right, now we're going to do the opposite. We're going to turn the high end or the tone all the way down to zero. And we'll see what effect that has. Okay, now I'm just going to indulge myself. I'm going to try what I think are some great settings on both of these pedals. They're fairly similar. You'll probably notice the Bad Monkey. I've had to pull the game back a long way. It does have a lot more gain, a lot more punch. And those two controls there give you just a little bit more control. This sounds great. It's still quite, you know, beefy and does what a Tube Screamer does. This one does all the things a Tube Screamer does, and it's got a little bit more gain, and it's got a little bit more control. So, have a listen, make your own conclusions. Here we go. Tube Screamer first. Bad monkey. Okay, here's your challenge. What I've done is I've dialed in a tone. I'm not going to tell you which one it is. I'm going to play that tone. You tell me which one you think it is. Leave a comment. Let me know. Don't forget, leave a comment at the end. Tell me what you think of the pedals. I think they both do a pretty good job. Um, you tell me which one you think is the best, which one has the edge, which one does more. And uh, like and subscribe. Hit that subscribe button for more videos on the way.